Oh my God. Hello and welcome today to Psychic Interactive. Thank you very much for being with us. And um, it's good to be here. If you are a regular, you know I haven't been here for a few days, but I am back with a vengeance and we've got two of the best psychics in the house today. We have the beautiful Imbal, who I know you know from many different publications and shows, but she is here with us and we're keeping her. So make the most of it today. And we also have the wonderful, equally beautiful Harry. Thank you. And they've both got fascinating cards. We have the Thoth deck over there with it Very good. And we improving. have um, the, the I Ching the e -Ging. and the Voyager Tarot. And the Voyager Tarot. So if you want to know more about those, send us a text to get involved because we are interactive. So if you want any questions answered about the psychic world or just what's happening in your life, uh, pick up your mobile phone and punch in the word TV, leave a space and then send your message up to 87777. If you'd like to send a text but you want to keep it a bit private and confidential, we understand that. And we have a wonderful psychic called Vass working for us behind the scenes, tirelessly answering all those private texts. All you need to do is text the word mystic, leave a space, then your message, and again send it off to 87777. So all the texts always go to 87777, just slightly different beginnings to them. If you'd like to leave us a live call or comment, which is exactly like an answer machine message, only better, because obviously it's the left here, you've got 30 seconds to do it in, uh, so just speak slowly and clearly, and please leave your name. Uh, it's really nice to know who we're talking to, and I know with the psychics, it does make more of a difference to your reading. Also, date of birth, very, very important. If you can do that, it's helpful. And remember, the more specific the question, the more specific the answer. So don't hold back and give us a call on 0905 652 We've also got our off-screen psychics. So if you want a kind of really full-on reading, um, maybe you've never had one before and you're thinking, mm, I might like to try this out and see what's you know going to happen in the next year then you need to be calling our off-screen psychics on this number at the bottom of the screen, 0906 125 If you'd like to know a bit more about that, please log on to our wonderful website. It's www.psychic-tv.com. Now, there you can see a list um, scrolling up and down of all of the off-screen psychics. Two are already busy. There's a short biog about um, most of them. I can see some of them haven't got their biogs up there. But uh, give them a call. Find out what they specialise in. We've got every kind of psychic there, whether it's a medium, clairvoyant, a healer. Maybe you're thinking, oh, that's the trouble. I don't know which one to go to. Give them a call. They will be happy to guide you through. And remember, it is your reading. You make it as long or as short as you want. So I know some people go, oh, it's going to cost a fortune. If you actually work out the price, it's probably the same, if not quite a lot less, if you're in a sort of, you know, big city than having a reading with, um, you know, a psychic that you go out to see at their home or, or whatever. Right, those are the numbers at the moment. You can speak to Imbal and Harry a little bit later on in the studio, so I'll let you know about that later. There's also a great chat room on the website, so get involved, join up. You know, it's free to do, and um, it's very, very good fun. We are going to hit those texts. I'm not sure whether we're playing catch-up from yesterday. If we are, apologies, and we will be getting to you right now, the minute it comes to screen. So quick reminder, if you want to send a text, it's TV, leave a space, then your message to 87777. Right, okay. Have we got any texts coming? Uh, oh, okay, technical hit. So, yeah. Harry, can you take a card for me? Certainly. <laughs> I do. You know, so oh. I always get the readings. Look at that. Jumped out. Yeah, jumped out. Uh, the, the, the family jumped out. Oh, yeah. So oh. it really shows that it's a time for you to be with your family. Uh huh. It's and my grandmother's birthday. Oh, that's what you just said. Okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's a time for you to be thinking about your family and to think mm -hmm. about joining them. And I, I know that you're actually going to be with them yes, uh, am, in the yeah. next couple of weeks. So I, that, that's quite. Days. <laughs> <laughs> what am I going to do without you? That's fine. I'll, I'll be ringing and everything, and I'll leave my number. You know how we talk to the psychics? I wouldn't <laughs> mind doing some text from over for my holidays. I'll probably be so bored. We're going to have to meet in the, um, in the chat room. Yes. That's yeah, what we do. I've met your brother there before, haven't I? Is it? Yes, you have. <laughs> and my parents have been on the chat room as well. <laughs> my brother's been in the chat room as well. <laughs> oh, I mean, we all keep, keep yeah. up to date with that, which is why it's such a brilliant thing. Just for that reason, if you're away at Christmas, you know, log on, tell us what you're up to. Should we pick a card for everyone for the day as well? I think we should. I think we should too. Okay, there we go. The three of wands. Um, the, the, the message of the three of wands is really. Oh, where are we? Where are we? Okay, there we go. Is um, 
Okay, we're coming up to Christmas time, aren't we? So everybody's getting into this mood of, uh, oh, it's Christmas, you've got to be nice to your neighbours. But the message of this card is, why leave it just at Christmas? Why not have that Christmas spirit all year round? I mean, it's a very, it's a very religious. Well, I mean, it's no no longer religious for a lot of people, but they still believe in that Christmas message. So what this card is telling you is, forget Christmas, but be a nice person to your neighbour for the rest of the year. Oh, okay, that's very I've very got nice. The two of swords that I think sort of complements that perfectly because that's about being nice to yourself as well, yeah. about a sort of inner peace and inner balance, and one sort of causes the other. It's very chicken and egg, isn't it? When you're sort of nice to everybody and you walk around in the streets and thinking, yeah, I've done good things. People smile back at you. It's true. Yeah. And then you feel like doing more good things. Apart from in London sometimes. I'm just surprised <laughs> they think you're and crazy. They think you're mad. <laughs> <laughs> Either that or they think you're available and yeah. yep. follow you home. <laughs> well, you say hello to somebody and think, what do they want? <laughs> Carefully smile at. Yeah. <laughs> Don't do it late at night on the tube. <laughs> but I think that's only in central London, really. No, true. <clears throat> but that's lovely. Very nice sentiment to start the day with. Yeah. <clears throat> so um, let's all be nice to each other. We've got Anonymous there, but you're letting us know it's Jan. Hello, sweetheart. Thank you for being with us. Um, my ex, date of birth, 21st of the 10th, 66, and you are the 13th of the 2nd, 64. Will relationship be rekindled? Ta. Okay, well, yes, I will do. Yes, relationships. I think we're going to see more of these. Like, oh, okay, exes no. And um, the, the, the problem with the, I'm going to have to get used to this camera at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, the problem with the relationship is that the, the, you know whatever went on beforehand, I don't think you're able to reconcile to, uh, with each other right now. You, you've gone too far. You, you've you've separated too far from each other. So it doesn't look like uh, you, you will get back together. But just to find out what's happening for you, there, what they have the woman of crystals. Uh, the title of that is guardian. So really, what I was saying earlier on, or what Inbal was saying earlier on about being nice to yourself, is very much reflected in this card. It's a time for you now to pamper yourself. Okay, you may be out of that relationship, but look at all, everything you can do now by yourself without having to worry about your partner proven or disapproving. Mm. Very true. So, best of luck there. I know it's this time of year, I think especially, you start thinking, mm, you know, was the ex that bad? It's quite nice to be with someone. Don't give in, please. There's a reason he's an ex. And, um, you know, there's a whole new year coming up very soon, which is exciting. We have got Nick, 1578, and we know who that is. It's the wonderful Laurie. Hello, sweetheart. How are you today? Hi, all. Can you pick a couple of cards for me today? Love and light always. And that's from Laurie, one of our favourites and our regulars yeah, here. Yeah, it's an honour to pick cards for Laurie. Ask for a couple, so a couple she shall have. And they are not as um, sort of spiritual as Laurie's cards often are, but they're more of sort of happiness and being happy. You know when you sort of sometimes go to work, like the Seven Little Dwarves, and it's you know, really happy making well, hay. Hey-ho. It, it, yeah, I was it, like that today. I was yeah. like, like, glad to be at the house. I can't like, believe I actually left the house for the last few days. Exactly. <laughs> so for Laurie today, it's really just taking pleasure in the simplest, simplest things. Anything that that sort of mundane and ordinary feels very blessed. I think because with Laurie we spoke um, earlier in the week about her sort of improvement or development going in fits and starts and she just went through a really strong sort of spiritual awakening thing and um, it does make you more, you know, drunk about everything. True. Ooh, this is beautiful. <laughs> Oh, I think that's lovely. Yeah. Thanks, Laurie. Really glad you're with us today. We have got our first live call to comment. Let's see who's on the line. Hello. Hi, I'm an Aryan. Um, I just wanted to know if you could just tell me if I am with the right man. Um, my birthday is um, the 11th of the 4th, 71. Many thanks. Bye. Okay, are you with Thank the right you. man indeed? All right, yes, you are with the right man. And it might be a little bit boring right now in your relationship, which might be the reason why you're calling me. Um, or calling us rather, but I'm telling you now, things are going to get really wild and exciting <laughs> for you, um, especially with the right kind of um, uh, attitude to your relationship. You know, get together, think about wild things you can do together, go away or even at home, and you're going to find that uh, you're going to have sparks coming off each other, really. So it's something for you to look forward to. Mm, definitely getting in the Christmas spirit then. <laughs> Thank you very much for that and speaking so slowly and clearly. 
If you would like to um, leave a live call or comment, the number is 0905 652 We have got D2 there. D, thank you so much for registering. Really, really makes a difference here because we are trying to sort of build up a community. Anyone that would like to register, it's simple to do. You do it once, then we always know who you are. You can use a nickname. Um, text the word reg, leave a space, and then your name or nickname off to 87777. Anyway, D is saying, will my partner and I make it through the tough times ahead together? Right, sticking together or not so sticking together. You know, it'll be easier if you were to go through the tough times apart, to be honest. I don't see either of you sort of wanting to split up, nor do I see either of you wanting to get together with anyone else, but it just says that it will be the clever thing to do it apart. So it might be sort of very, very real issues that each of you needs to deal with, if it's court cases, children things. It's personal stuff, and whereas sometimes it's very nice to share, problem shared, problem halved, you've shared on the matter quite enough, and now it's really just sort of getting through the difficult times. Afterwards, together, or not so together? Mm. Afterwards, probably there'll be all those sort of, what do you call it, real things, life that will keep you apart. So it's not the most festive message for you there, D2. But um, you are asked to have to tell you the truth. Sorry. Okay, sweetheart. Thank you for that. We are going to go to a break, so stay connected, stay tuned. We will be back in three minutes with more Psychic Interactive. <laughs> Don't go away. We'll see you after the break.